guys, it's Victor, give me a break, man, and... Tomoko desu! Thanks for watching part one of our, of our 12 reasons Japanese are tough. Tough. And this is part two. This is part two, right? right? And if you haven't seen part one, please click. We'll put a... We'll put something, an annotation right there. Over there? Okay, over there. Over there? <laughs> Somewhere on this video, there will, there will be an annotation. Uh, this video was brought to you by italki.com, which is a great way to learn a language. Hi. Now, I have a Japanese teacher. If you, I have a Tomoko. If you, do you have a Tomoko? <laughs> if you don't have a Tomoko, you can get your own Tomoko. <laughs> Not exactly the same, but I'm sure you can find <laughs> someone who will do the job for you. As in a Japanese teacher, by going to italki.com. Go to italki.com. <laughs> italki Make an account. Account to tsukuru. Choose a language. Gengo o kimeru. Pick a teacher. Sensei o erabu. Schedule a class. Class o toru. And eat some pie. Apple pie tameru to ka jinakute. Because it's easy as pie, that's all you gotta do. Anyway, <laughs> check out the rest of our video. This is part two of why Japanese are tough. Number seven. Number seven. Seiza. Seiza. Koko utsura nai ka yattara. Seiza. This is Seiza. So how long can you stay in Seiza position? Zutto. Really? Zutto, really? Really? Zutto. Really? That's impressive. You're tough. You're tough. Really? Zutto. 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 Let's say that. Oh, the other thing about uh, not just say that, but let me talk about the Japanese legs for a minute. Okay. Okay. So, the squat toilet, squat toilet. Okay. Japanese legs are different. First of all, Japanese legs in in in, in general are shorter, right? Well, we're, of course, we're different heights, but their torsos are generally uh, longer than ours, and their legs are generally shorter, right? But they can bend. They can. They have their their muscles here. Their front muscles here are more elastic. So for example, when you have to squat over a toilet, imagine there's a hole there, and you have to squat. My heels, I, I can't keep my heels past that point. It starts going up. See, my heels go up, yeah. right? But look at Tomoko. Look at her. Look at her heels. Her heels are all the way at the ground, <laughs> and she can she can squat and poop properly. <laughs> right? No problem. Right? <laughs> but I can't. So if I if I were if I were that, I would be like, oh my god, I got I need something to hold on to. See, I can do it if I hold on to something, but I can't do it like that. It's really hard. So Japanese legs are different. And, hold on, when you're doing seiza, when, when you're doing seiza, you can do seiza on the chair, right? Yeah. And girls will often do seiza on the chair. Yes. Right? You'll often see women, even on the subway, like, even, even on the subway, I've seen women like this, right? In the classroom. In the classroom, yeah. So people sit like, some people are quite comfortable doing seiza. Yeah. Japanese are weird. Okay. <laughs> Number eight. Seiza. And interesting, interestingly enough, the kanji for seiza, <laughs> what does it mean? Tadashi. Correct. Correct. Sitting. Sitting. Correct sitting. Correct. Okay. So it's the correct word said. Okay, <laughs> number eight. Natto. Really? I guess it is kind of tough. So it means Japan loves natto, not the food tasting. Well, you, I guess most Americans, most Westerners will agree that natto, if you can eat natto, you're tough. Yeah. We're tough, no problem. Okay, it's yeah, it's just a gross food, <laughs> but that that many Japanese love because they're used to it. But okay. some Japanese hate it too, right? Mm, okay, number nine. Packed trains, mind desha. Mind desha. Ma means full. Full, 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 full. In is people. Densha is train. So basically, packed train. Yeah. And I agree. Ne. I w I'm glad I don't live in Tokyo for that reason. It's miserable. I've taken the. the I've been there rush rush hour a few times. It, they do push you, and and I guess Osaka may be similar. Nagoya is not so bad. I mean, we're a big city, but yeah, it's not like that. When I lived in Tokyo, really? Did you did you enjoy? Yes, it's <laughs> 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 So, so that's another reason uh, living in Japan is tough hey. or Japanese is tough. Okay, number 10 is Winter Fundoshi. Fundoshi. Fuyuba ni Fundoshi Matsuri ga aru. Yes. So. For example, the naked Matsura. So that. Naked Matsura? Matsuri. Matsuri. <laughs> I will give you a picture of myself wearing this. This is a very embarrassing picture here. Hadaka de. 
There it is. Look, I know I'm out of shape. I don't need the, I don't need the comments. Keep them to yourself. I know. I know what I am. You should have seen me in my prime. We can still kick some ass, though. Okay. But I would. I will tell you that uh, it is torture. Torture. The the naked festival was torture. Mm -hmm. Really, really, really miserable. Um, for the, uh, for the first two or three hours. Uh. <laughs> and then after that, you're like, you just warm up. You get used to it. But it it is really painful. And not just me, the Japanese too. Everyone just freezing. Yeah, it builds character. Number 11, please. No matter how old you are, you hike. Now the Jap the English says everyone over 60 is hiking. But the Japanese says it doesn't matter what age you become, you're hiking. A lot of old hikers in Japan. You see them all over the place. Ah, so you start hiking when you get older. Keep walking. You can't die if you keep walking. So A lot of older hikers in Japan. I guess I, I would say my impression is older Americans do not hike or exercise that much in general? You think so? No, we die. You, we, Americans die. No. Forget it. Well, my dad's got a bad hip. You know. TV, go to movies. Got a big, beautiful chair. It's great. But hiking, yeah, a lot of beautiful places to hike in Japan in the country. The last one is. Abunai Matsuri. Abunai Matsuri. Dangerous Abunai. Matsuri festivals. Ah, They're dangerous festivals. There are some weird festivals here. Fire, People die. Fire, fire, fire festivals. Mm, mm, mm. What? Himatsuri. 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 Oh, Himatsuri. 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 Himatsuri is fire. Festival. People die. Oh. There's old women. Wow. She's really old. Oh, 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 oh. It happens sometimes. Everyone's... You get on a horse and... And run up the hill? Okay. That's dangerous. People die sometimes. Okay. Well, I think, you know, this happens everywhere in the world. They got crazy festival. Like the running of the bulls in Pamplona. That's crazy. The running, the running of the bulls in Spain. In Spain. Oh, shit. I'm sure that stuff happens everywhere. But there was one, we were discussing this article before, and Tomoko mentioned one thing that's not on the list. Why, why are Japanese tough? That is one of their, and, and the other word brought up was bitoku. Bitoku である. So what, what is it again? So their well patience is a virtue. So it's mo gaman shte gaman shte te so that's Especially Japanese wives. So gaman gaman it's mo gaman. The Japanese wives are known for putting up with a lot of shit. A lot of shit. A lot of stuff. A lot putting up being patient, being very good patient wives. Right? No, let's change. Let's change from now on. But yeah, Japanese are known for putting up with a lot, and that's why um, they do. They put up with a lot of bad situations, and the whole like working in the office, the office ladies and mm. salary men just have to put up. Gaman, 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 gaman. So when you hear that, it's a little bit like saying, "Don't give up. Right? Mm. Keep trying." It's a little bit like what's it, in a way, it's a little bit like gambate. Mm. Sometimes gaman means gambate. Sometimes no. What do you think? Ma gaman, gambate. I mean, completely different meaning, but. You might say it to. Gamaste. Gamaste. Gamaste is like do your best, but gamaste is put up with it. Don't give up. Don't don't give up. Kind of thing. So so. So it's true. I think I think generally speaking, uh, I don't. But is it is it really a virtue? Bitoku kana. Is it really a virtue or is it? Mm. But is it a, is it good or do you think it's bad? Eh, sometimes. Ma, それはね両方 both. Sometimes I think it's not so good. Sometimes complaining is good. I think. 
Anyway, tell us what you think, if, or if you think there's another reason Japanese are tough. Tough, <laughs> don't And or, or do you think Japanese are tough? If you don't, let us know in the comments. <laughs> but thanks for watching, everyone. Hi, thank you. Talk to you guys soon. Bye. Thanks for watching our video. Did you like the video? Then you give us a uh, thumbs up. Leave us a comment. Tell, tell us if you think these are really good reasons for. We didn't make the list, right? We didn't make the list. So <laughs> tell us what you think about the reasons that Japanese are tough. And if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe. I have two channels: Give Me Break Man, Give Me Flake Man, and Tomoko got her own channel at Tomo. What is it? Bowie Tomo zero eight zero three. Links somewhere on the screen <laughs> and in the description. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you guys in the next video. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no. 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 Oh, no.